Good morning, good morning. Welcome to Saturday Circle with Miss Diana. It is so wonderful to have you join me this morning. If you know this song, I want you to go ahead and sing it along with me. I call it my good morning song. All right, sing it along with me. Good morning, good morning, good morning. How are you? I'm fine, I'm fine. And I hope that you are too. Buenos dias, buenos dias. Como estas? Como estas? Muy bien, gracias. Muy bien, gracias. Y usted, y usted. Good job. Yes, I do do. Um, I want you to repeat after me. So that sometimes you might see my ear go like this. But it means I just want you to go ahead and repeat after me. But let's do this. Have you ever counted in Spanish? I like to add that along to my good morning song just because. So let's go ahead and just count to 10, all right? Uno, dos, tres. Cuatro, cinco, seis, siete, ocho, nueve, diez. You have 10 fingers and you count it to 10 in Spanish. Yay. All right, all right. Now we're going to go ahead and move along to our calendar. All right, do you guys know what the month is right now? What month are we in? Here's your hint. We're in the month of June. Can you say June? June, yes. If you clap it out, June has one syllable. June. And you spell it J-U-N-E. Now, these are all the days in the month of June. That means June is almost over. We have one more week, a few more days of June left, and we're done. All right? We got about five more days of June left. So we're going to count all the days in June so far. So I want you to count along with me. And if you are in an area where you can get out of a chair and you can stand up and you can jump, I love jump counting. So you can count and jump at the same time, all right? So let's go ahead and get started, ready? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen, eighteen, nineteen, twenty. 21, 22, 23, 24, 25. Yay! 25 days into the month of June. Wow. Kind of feel like June went a little slow, right? I know some of you guys just got out of school like a week or two ago. So maybe it's gone fast for you though. But we are 25 days. Oh, I lost the number. 25 days into the month of June. Now, yesterday my very most favorite day of the week was friday all right yesterday was friday today is saturday and tomorrow will be sunday it's the weekend happy friday yesterday was yes fridays are my absolute favorite right so let's sing a little song i want you to sing it along with me if you know it all right days of the week 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 there is Sunday and there's Monday, there's Tuesday and there's Wednesday, there's Thursday and there's Friday, and then there's Saturday. Days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week, days of the week. Good job. All right. So today is Saturday, June the 25th. It's, the year is 2022. All right, what are your plans for today? Where I live, it is rainy. It is rainy today. But guess what? Since we last met, we are officially in summer. We are officially in summer. So I know you can't see my board back here, but I'm going to put the summer marker up on my board. All right, we are officially in summer. We are officially in summer. All right. All right, guys, so we're gonna go ahead and get started. I have a wonderful book to read today, but we're gonna go ahead and review some letters in letter sounds. And we're gonna do capital letters today and I went ahead and put them in order this time because there may be some younger friends that are joining us and I figure why not all right so we're gonna go over some letter sounds if you know your letters and the sounds I want you to say them with me okay a says ah 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 alligator b says b b b ball c says k k k 
cake. D says D, 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 Diana. E says eh, 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 elephant. F says frog. G says G, 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 guitar. H says house. I says eh, 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 insect. J says j, 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 jump. K says k, 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 kite. L says oh, 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 Liana. My daughter's name is Liana. And Lauren. M says mmm, 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 money. Mmm, or milk, or mommy. I know you guys say that one all the time. N says n, n, new. O says ah, 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 otter. P says p, 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 popcorn, p, p, or Peppa Pig. Q says qua, 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 queen, or question. R says, er, 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 rainbow. S says, s, 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 snake. S, isn't that pretty cool that the snake actually says, s, and that's the sound that S makes? T says, t, 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 tiger, t, t, tiger. Let me hear you roar, Rawr, tiger. U says, uh, 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 up. Go up, uh, uh, up. V says, mm, 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 vacuum. Do you like to vacuum? Mm. That's the sound that V makes. It sounds just like a vacuum. Mm. W says, wah, 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 wagon. Wah, wah, wagon or water. X says x, 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 x ray. Or you'll find a lot of X's at the end of words like box or fox or X. Y says y, yeah, y, yeah, y, yeah, yo, yo. Or yellow. And Z. Z says z like zip line. Have you ever wrote a zip line? zip line all right good job those are you know it is very important to learn those letters and letter sounds so that you can begin to put those letters together to form words now i have three brand new sight words for today i'm gonna go over our three from the last time we have the t-h-e of o-f and and a-n-d those are our sight our sight words from the previous weeks now these are our new sight words. A, just the letter A. Yes, that is a sight word. Two, T-O, two. And N, I, N. So let's use these three words in a sentence. A, I am going to a birthday party. Yes, I actually am taking my children to a birthday party. A, let's use the same sentence. I am going to, going to a birthday party, T-O-2, or I am going to the store. I'm going to school. I have to go do my homework. Can you think of a sentence using the, the word to, the sight word to, or sight word A? Mm -hmm. The last one is in, I-N. It is time to go in for dinner. You might be playing outside a lot. And when mom or whatever who whatever adult is um, watching you at the time says it's time to come in, it is time to come in. I in. And so I'm sure that you're very obedient and you do exactly what you were told right away, right? <laughs> All right, so those are our three sight words for today. A, two, and I want you to look for those words in your books 
when you are reading and as well as try to think of some sentences that you could use um, using those words. All right. Now we're going to get started. I have a I had a request today. I don't know the young lady's name. It was a little girl. She was three years old. I'm not sure of her name, but her mom reached out to me. So I wanted to read a book. She really liked Peppa Pig. So I wanted to read a book called Best Friends. And it's by, it's about Peppa Pig, but it is a scholastic book. I know you guys probably have lots and lots and lots of scholastic books at home, right? I know we do, but this one is called Best Friends. So if you like Peppa Pig, make sure you put those listening ears on so that you can hear. All right, we're going to go ahead and get started. Best Friends, that's our title. Once upon a time, Peppa's best friend, Susie Sheep, came to play. I have something to show you, said Susie. Susie held up a photograph of a baby sheep. Look! It's me, says Susie. You're not a baby, Susie, said Peppa, shaking her head. This is an old photo, Susie explained. It was taken when I was a baby. Peppa snorted. She didn't remember Susie being a baby. That was just silly. Susie pointed at Peppa. In the olden days, you were a baby too, she said. I don't remember being a baby, said Peppa. But you were, insisted Susie. Ask your mummy. We all were babies at some point. Peppa and Susie raced inside. Mummy Pig was working on the computer. Mummy, cried Peppa. Susie is making up stories. No, I'm not, said Susie. Peppa told Mummy Pig about Susie's silly idea. I don't remember being a baby, Peppa insisted. But you were a baby, Peppa, said Mummy Pig. Mummy Pig pulled up a picture of a baby pig on the computer. Who do you think this is, Peppa? She asked. Peppa thought that the baby looked like her cousin, Baby Alexander. Is it Baby Alexander, she asked. No, replied Mummy Pig, that's you as a baby. Peppa? Peppa was surprised she had been a baby. <laughs> Peppa said Susie giggled. Peppa and Susie giggled, but baby Peppa looked very cute. Look at little baby Peppa. Little baby Peppa Pig. She's so cute. George and Daddy Pig came in to see what all the fuss was about. Look, Daddy, said Peppa. There's me as a baby. I remember it, said Daddy Pig. That photo was taken on our first date in this home. What do you mean, asked Peppa. Daddy Pig told Peppa, Peppa, Susie, and George that they had moved into their house when Peppa was very little. We bought all of our things on the top of our car, he said. Mummy Pig put up some pictures and Daddy Pig, said Daddy Pig. Daddy Pig put up a shelf, said Mummy Pig. And Grandpa Pig made us a lovely flower garden. Oh, pretty. Peppa and Susie went outside. There was no flower garden at the house. At, there was no flower garden at this house. Uh, why don't we have a flower garden now, said Peppa. We used to, but Daddy Pig looked after it, Mummy Pig sighed. Um, said Daddy Pig, uh, embarrassed. We had the wrong kind of soil for the flowers. Yeah, yeah, that's it. Why did Susie... Why was Su was Susie my friend in the olden days? Asked Peppa. Daddy Pig nodded. Of course, he said. He 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 he. It's Peppa and Susie. You and Susie have always been best friends. Peppa wondered what games she played with Susie when they were little. Did we jump up and down in muddy puddles? She asked. No, Mummy Pig laughed. You were babies. You couldn't even walk yet. when we were babies, asked Susie. You cried, you burped, and you laughed, said Mummy Pig. Susie and Peppa giggled. It must have been a silly, it must have been so silly being a baby. <laughs> baby Peppa, baby Susie. <laughs> then you grew into toddlers, continued Mummy Pig, and you played together all the time. 
But where was George, Peppa asked. He was a baby in my tummy, said Mummy Pig. Peppa thought for a moment, Daddy Pig's tummy was never bigger. Was e Daddy, let me start over, hold on. Daddy Pig's tummy was even bigger than Mummy Pig's. Is there a baby in there? She asked. No, Peppa, chuckled Daddy Pig. This tummy is pure muscle. <laughs> Woo. Soon, George was born, Mummy Pig said, and Granny and Grandpa brought him a very special present. Can you guess what it was, Peppa? Peppa knew just what the present, just what present it, was, it must have been. Mr. Dinosaur, she cried. Goo, goo, girl. Look at baby George and look at his dinosaur. Daddy Pig said that little Peppa and Susie like to do everything together. They like to jump, hee, 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 la, 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 dance. And run around all over the place. Snort, <laughs> boo, or bad. <laughs> then one day, said Mommy Pig, you saw something amazing. <gasps> A muddy puddle! <gasps> you love jumping up and down in muddy puddles together, said Mommy Pig. Do you like jumping up and down in muddy puddles? Peppa, George, and Susie all ran outside. I still love muddy puddles, cried Peppa. Me too, cried Susie. Peppa, George, and Susie looked for the biggest muddy puddle they could find and jumped right in. Daddy Pig brought his camera. Let's take a photo of you, Susie, and George now, Peppa, he said. Yes, exclaimed Peppa, because Susie and I were best friends in the olden days and we're still best friends now. Click, picture perfect. Little or big, Peppa and Susie will always be best friends and they will always love jumping up and down in muddy puddles. The end. I hope you enjoyed that story of Peppa, Pig, and Susie Sheep being best friends, all right? That is all for Saturday Circle with Miss Deanna today. I hope you've enjoyed the lesson and I hope you learned a lot and had some fun and enjoyed the story. Well, that's all that I have for today. I hope to see you again here next Saturday with another wonderful lesson and another wonderful story. So enjoy the rest of your Saturday and I will see you next time, my friends. Thank you for watching. Bye.